Well, I want to thank everybody who's ordered from the BrickLink store in these first three days. Uh, it'll be four days by the time you watch this video, but uh, July 1st through July 3rd, we've already had 19 orders, which for a store of my size, that's really good. That's average of over six orders a day. <laughs> And you, you get caught up in an order and then another one drops in. So it's a good problem to have. Um, and it came at a good time for me personally. Um, had some bills I needed to pay. And, um, it's, yeah, it's just nice to be able to, to, to do that. So all this money that I've made from your purchases in my store has actually been going towards bills. <laughs> <laughs> and, and so I want to thank uh, some of the people recently, uh, like David Elder, who's, I think he's placed like 18 orders in my store. He, um, we didn't do a Pablo on his, but David, thank you so much. I um, appreciate uh, your orders. Uh, my wife, I think, picked your order earlier today as I'm filming this and then sent it out. And he said, he said, he had a note on here. Said, "Glad to see your new kitty. I've been sick, but still buying clearance Lego nearly every day." <laughs> uh, oh, and I think I mentioned it in the previous one of the previous videos. But July is a good month for clearance, and I've seen some really good deals on Amazon. Um, somebody mentioned something to me. I actually got to go um, to YouTube and look at that. But uh, I had pointed out some things like the po the the party bus that was on sale. And um, there were other things, and there's one that I was actually thinking of getting to part out because I'm looking at things that are at least a three to four times. Really, I want stuff that, like, if you pay $50 for it, it's got $200 in parts. And you may say, well, that's ridiculous. But um, there was one, let's see if I can find that comment. Um, <laughs> I don't know if I can find the comment now. Oh boy. Oh, I found it. It's from Midnight Cat Bricks. The pop up book was also on sale for $43. So a set that's normally $70 has a part out value of about $150 for $43. That's more than three times. Uh, so I think that's a good one to get. I think they have a limit of three uh, there. Uh, I don't know how many orders you can place, but um, that's one I'm thinking of getting um but anyway i got a we're gonna be doing a pablo here for dr create who is in the uk it's actually my first international order uh, since reopening the store and i've i've had I had a lot of comments about the international orders and how expensive it is and i just everybody know that's the reason why a lot of us here in the united states don't ship internationally is because it's so expensive i I feel guilty charging that amount, and usually I'm charging less than what I actually pay. Uh, for instance, I'm pretty sure this one's going to cost me almost $15 to ship, and it, I think it's $13.50 was the shipping. It, it may be, it may be close to that. It just depends on the ounces, but I appreciate ones like Doctor Create, who is he's actually buying some pretty neat things. <laughs> He says, oh, he's got a message here. He says, hi, I'm I'm a fan from across the pond. Can I request a Pablo for this order and one of your famous red sign bricks? And also, I'd love uh, to add, he said, I'd also to add, love the YouTube channel. You inspired me to start my own store last year, and I have enjoyed running it so far. Thank you. All right, thank you. I appreciate that, uh, Dr. Create. So he'll be getting brick 124. And I'm sorry for a lot of the people. I've had to go to the used bricks. I do not have any more new 2x4 red bricks. I've done, this is 124, and I've done more than that. There's a couple of mistakes, and some people got higher numbers than that. I am keeping a list of all the numbers. I haven't shown my ugly face on camera. I just don't feel up to it today. It's, it's one of those things I literally sit down here for about 20 minutes before I started filming. I was just like, I don't feel like doing this. Not not picking the order. I mean, picking the order is no problem, but just getting on camera. I enjoy at the end that I have the videos and I enjoy the people that request them and I enjoy talking to you. Sometimes that's cathartic, but sometimes getting started is my, my hardest part. So that's a neat little Hero Factory trans clear element he got there. 
I think this is a really cool part, this trans bright green. It just looks cool. It's not as, it, like, it doesn't radiate under the um, the black light, but it, it looks cool just in natural light. Yeah, before long I have got to start parting out some more stuff. This the box is full. <laughs> got some dark red plates here. Ten of them. Oh, that's more than ten. See, I, see, I did now. Two, four, six, eight. Oh, I got exactly ten. That's not bad. Uh, I need thirty of these. So one by one, blue plates. So one thing sellers do is they'll have like you can buy a specific quantity, and I honestly don't remember if I did that on this but this is awesome because he ordered 200 of these I guess the way to do it and I really probably need to do it more often on the smaller parts like this is to uh, offer a discount if you buy, buy quantities of, of a certain amount so like this is pre-counted so all I got to do is grab it I don't have to count out 200 of them this piece looks bigger on the picture. It's a one by one. It almost looked like a two by two on the picture. It's a little clock. There was a time. Uh oh. Where's the drawer? What did I do? The wrong drawer? 2762, and it's supposed to be 2672. I am so tired. Worked all day. Um, he got all these dark green, but there was a, what I was going to say before. There, there was a time you would never find one by ones in my store because I used to keep them, but I found that I got plenty of one by ones. Although I probably don't have dark green ones. Hmm. Oh well, I sold them now. Oh, thirty seventy eight. He got twelve of these double cheese. And this is one we had just added to the store. He got the rest of them inverted uh, plate there with the what do you call it? Um, is that flames? I don't know what that is. Thirty-six eighty-one. Forty thirty-five. Uh oh, can I get both of those? I think so. Yep. Uh-oh. This box is way down here on the bottom. <laughs> One of the largest quantities ever that I parted out was the final duel too. That was back in the eBay days. I, was, I still got all these in, one of the few instruction manuals that are in my store. So this came in a box that was small. Uh, so the instructions were folded. So that's the crease that you see on there because it was uh, tri-folded uh, like that. But that's not the way I had been storing it. Cup, oh, this one, cup 28. I need to get 20 of these. Oh, you got one out of the Poppy Max. Oh, we're getting these things empty. That's what I want. going to get the BrickLink store. Actually, I can transfer some of the rest of these into some of those, and that'll help. Yeah, get rid of these being used for the BrickLink store and just have them for personal. So I've got some out of the sticker binder, which actually I put some Chima things in here the other day. But that's not what he ordered. He ordered this sticker here. Put it with the instruction manual. No, sir, that's incorrect. He ordered this sticker. <laughs> I just saw the 24. It's the bottom. He wanted the one in the bottom. And yellow J4. Got three of these. These are from an advent calendar. So all I got to do is bag this up now. So that's Dr. Create's order. Thank you, Dr. Create. Going to the UK. Appreciate that. And, um,. Probably do another video. Maybe I need to break down some Q and A about BrickLink. Um, I get a lot of questions, and I'm really tired right now, so sorry if I'm rambling. But I'm one of those people. I feel like I feel obligated sometimes to answer the questions, uh, but sometimes the questions are ones that I shouldn't have to answer, and and I, I don't want to come across the wrong way because I appreciate the patronage of people buying from the store. Uh, but one of the questions I get is, do you have this in your store, so-and-so piece? Do you have 
this piece in your store or these pieces in your store and I'm like just look now I can understand that sometimes uh, we don't know what to describe the pit part if you're especially if you're new to BrickLink you might not know how to look if you wanted one of these and you didn't know what set it was in but you knew you, you'd seen it somewhere and you're like oh I want that piece you might not know know how to describe it so you might not know how to find it in the store uh, but usually just like I don't know <laughs> I can understand that, but I, I, that's not what it is because sometimes people are describing the part that they want they're, and they're still asking me, uh, please don't do that because just look in the store. <laughs> I do, it's like um, if uh, Arthur Blank owned Home Depot and he had his own store, one store, uh, he would obviously, anybody come in the store, he'd go help them find what they were looking for. Uh, but when he started opening multiple stores, he couldn't, as a individual, expect to handle all the the questions about where the hammers are in the store. <laughs> you know, he, and I, I know I'm just one store, and I guess that was a bad analogy, but I don't have time to shop for other people. <laughs> it's like, I, you're not calling up... Scott Bezos to, to shop Amazon for you. You go look, you hit, you put your thing that you're searching for in the search bar <laughs> and you go and look for it. So I just don't have time. And I, and I, I'm, I know it's, it's probably, I sound terrible talking about this. I look terrible right now, which is why I'm not on camera. And tell me if I'm wrong, but tell me if I sounded bad, but I'm just, I'm having a bad day, and it's just one of those things I was just thinking of right now. That um, I appreciate the orders we got. Like I said, we had 19 in three days, but there's a couple of people that were asking for like what piece if I have a certain piece, and I just don't have time to answer that. But sorry to put this in your video, Doctor Create. Thank you for your order. Uh, he was able to order all this all on his own <laughs> without me helping. <laughs> And I appreciate it. And I hope it arrives safe and sound in a timely way in the UK. Now, here in the United States, the July 4th day is a postal holiday. The post office will not be open on July 4th. So these will be shipped uh, July 5th. So thank you for the order. And thank you people who watch this video and my ramblings on... Maybe tomorrow will be a better day. <laughs> But you guys have brightened my day by helping me out with these uh, BrickLink orders in a time that I needed them. So thank you so much. And we'll see you next time. Bye.